Thank you, Kristen. A Chicopee woman says three men stole her wallet in broad daylight. And she's speaking exclusively to Western Mass News tonight, hoping to warn other women. Plus, the scammers were caught on camera. Western Mass News reporter Paris Dunn for joining us live with those details. Paris. Chris, Mary, this Chicopee woman tells me she didn't think anything like this would ever happen in broad daylight. Now she wants to warn other women to be aware no matter the time of day. Catherine DeFranco was picking up some groceries at the Stop and Shop on Memorial Drive in Chicopee around 11.30 one morning last week. Once she got into her car to drive away, a man on the other side of the car tried getting her attention. He wasn't even talking. He was just mumbling, ooh, you know. Take a look at this surveillance video Chicopee police shared with us from that day. In it, you can see three men circling the parking lot, one of them making a move once DeFranco gets in her car. You see him spraying something on DeFranco's tire and walking away. Then a second man comes to alert her. Now, while DeFranco is trying to figure out what the man is trying to tell her, the man who sprayed the tire comes back and is seen in the video getting into her car. I left the door open on, on the driver's side. Police say a third man seen in the video was keeping watch. DeFranco then gets back in the car and drives away. An hour later, DeFranco figured out what she just fell victim to. My wallet was gone. So right away, I had to make all kinds of calls and everything. My, But they did use my card. She tells Western Mass News the perpetrators racked up more than $2,000 on her credit cards. Now she spent the past week canceling her cards, trying to clean up the mess they made. Terrible. Because I, got a hu I have a husband home I'm taking care of, too, that's sickly. So, I mean, it, it's, I've been on the run, running all over. It's a very inconvenience. Chicopee Police Officer Travis Odeon tells us this has actually happened in other communities. They believe Framingham was one of them and also Agawam at this point. We're not sure if they're all the same people. However, they are using the same scheme. We received this video from our sister station WCVB, where they too interviewed a Framingham victim. Odeon says these criminals seem to be targeting elderly women who are alone shopping. He says it's important to be alert even in daylight hours. If someone approaches you and you find that odd, just put the window down, talk to them through the window. Um, if they persist that you get out, call 911. Now, Chicopee police are searching for the three men involved. Anyone with information is urged to contact the department. We did reach out to Stop and Shop, and they say they are aware of the incident and will continue to work with local authorities. Reporting live in studio, Paris Dunford for Western Mass News.